Wood, metal, concrete, plastic. Let's make it super hydrophobic fantastic. Hi, I'm Nick. And I'm Jordan. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Rust-Oleum Rust Never Wet Laboratory. Toilet brush to cheap to pay. What's it going to be today? Mr. Couture, you want to never wet a tent? Well, here we go. When you're setting up a tent for a camping trip, or sleeping in your own backyard because you're locked out of your own house from being at a stag all night, maybe we should change your name tag to say Mills Lane. Judge much? Anyways, the last thing you want to do when you're setting up a tent at four in the morning is get wet. Especially when it's raining. Which it started to do at 4 a.m. Which is the reason for this never wet lab test. To demonstrate some super hydrophobicity, we're going to treat half the tent and leave the other half untreated. First, the base coat, which is a nice even spray back and forth. Let it set for a half an hour or so. And then the top coat, again, nice and even, and we let it dry overnight. After five minutes, this side's starting to look like the Toronto Maple Leafs defense. Porous and unreliable. Same amount of time, same amount of water. Nothing coming through. Never wet. Get it? Never wet. And remember, if there's a use for never wet that you'd like to see us try, or a video of your own never wet experiment, send it to us through Facebook or Twitter. If we deem your idea worthy, you could win your very own official never wet lab coat. Uh, with my name tag on it. Or a good name, like mine. Wood, metal, concrete, plastic. Let's make it super hydrophobic fantastic!